We've just left the house we called home for the last six months. This was Ben's latest restoration project, and rather than taking on another project during these uncertain times, we thought we'd spend the winter at our apartment in Spain, using it as a base to explore from in our camper van. We jumped on the Euro Tunnel. The process was very straightforward given the current situation. The only change being that you have to remain in your vehicle during the crossing. We spent our first night at a park up that was in a little village about an hour or so from Calais. was spent at an air that had all the services needed for a camper van or motorhome. village called Bibon where we spent the night um, and now we're on our way to cross the Spanish border. We've got Pyrenees and 
across the Pyrenees Mountains. We've got 784 miles to our destination in um, Mercia in Spain. Um, and when did we leave the UK? Yesterday. Uh, the day before yesterday, yeah. we left home in England. Um, so we've drunk quite About a lot of miles. Five o'clock Wednesday. Yeah, five o'clock Wednesday afternoon we left. It's now Friday morning. And it's now Friday morning. Um, so we'll probably do what about three, four hundred miles today, mm. and then the rest of the journey to Mercia tomorrow. Um, it's a bit of a shame because we're cutting out a lot of a lot of France and a lot of places we want to see and stuff. But our aim at the moment is just to get straight to um, southern Spain. Um, but hopefully on our way back through to England, we'll spend more time in, in France. Yeah. Yeah. Of all that in the van anyway. So. Yeah, we're carrying a lot of stuff. I mean, it's quite, it's a bit of a mess at the moment. So the sooner we get to the apartment, the better. So yeah, we'll catch up with you in a little while. Buyer this morning in Spain. Um, we're just outside of Zaragoza. Um, wasn't the best night's sleep. Really noisy. The road was really noisy all night. But hey ho. Um, we did have a really nice spot, but it was really isolated, and it was just down a single track road, and we felt a bit. We just had that gut feeling that it, it, I don't know didn't quite feel right so we just moved on to this lay-by um, and sacrificed a, a pretty park up for a noisy lay-by but there you go it's just bad life for you it's not too bad as far as lay-bys go but yeah I think we're gonna go back in the van in a minute maybe have a little bit of breakfast have a cup of tea and then we're gonna hit the road come here We've got about 380 miles left of our journey to the apartment in Mercia. Um, so a few hours and we shall be there. Hopefully early afternoon we'll be there. Um, so we'll catch up with you in a bit. You ready to go? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yes. It smells the 
just saying. Look at the fridge open. <laughs> There's wine there. Look at the Hang on. We're here! Yeah. <laughs> we are here! Yeah. Home for the foreseeable. Bob, you still there? <laughs> Not too bad at it, considering it's had a storm. This is a brand new battery when I put it, when we brought it out. Mm. Uh, so that's a good thing. Yeah, when it's green, it opens it's good. Ready? concludes this video on our journey from the UK to Spain. We're here for a few months and in our spare time we're hoping to get around more of Spain in the camper van. If you want to follow along then subscribe to our channel and if you have any recommendations on places that we can visit then do let us know in the comment section. Thank you for watching our video. Hit that thumbs up button and we'll see you on the next one. We're staying here for a couple of months and uh oh, <laughs> <laughs> what? we're staying here for a few months and fuck <laughs> <laughs>